So you just got your new RV within command and you'd like to pair your iPhone. Grab it and let's get started. To begin pairing the iPhone to the in-command system, the first thing we'll do is on the iPhone. Tap on your settings icon and then tap on Bluetooth. And this screen shows all of the devices that are connected to your iPhone and the ones that aren't paired. We'll leave the phone on this screen and the next step is on the in-command display. We'll tap on settings and then Bluetooth and then pairing. This page shows all the paired devices and the unpaired devices. At the bottom of the in-command display, we'll see a button that says scanning. If it says scan, just tap on scan and it will become scanning. That's when you know the display is searching for nearby Bluetooth devices. In this case, we can see the name of our iPhone underneath the unpaired devices list. We'll tap that and then tap pair. A pairing request will pop up on both devices and we'll just hit pair on the display and then hit pair on the iPhone. The name of our iPhone should then appear under the paired list of the in-command display, and we'll see the name of the in-command display in the Bluetooth page of the iPhone. It will say not connected, but that's okay. Just tap on not connected, and it will become connected. Download the in-command app from the App Store. The app for the in-command with Global Connect system is the one with the three hexagons, and then click open. The app will ask you would like to allow some permissions. Please allow these for the app to work. The app will then have you watch a brief instructional video, followed by an end user's license agreement. Hit accept. And then the app will ask you to create a passcode. Note that this passcode is not associated with the passcode on the in-command display on the wall. Create a new four-digit PIN, and then enter it again to confirm that passcode. The next step is to copy the floor plan from the display to the app. RV Sync teaches your phone all of the functions that are installed to your in-command system. By default, the app has no idea how many slides, awnings, or lights are equipped. We'll tap on the gear wheel at the bottom of the app, and then tap on floor plan, and then tap RV Sync, and progress will begin towards 100%. Once it hits 100%, it will say floor plan is downloaded, and you can hit dismiss. We just finished pairing your iPhone to InCommand. If you have other questions, please visit InCommand.net for more information.